This is Family on YouTube. What's up, guys? I'm Trevor Torridgeman, and I play James on The Next Step. And we're here today with musician and actor Shane Hart, who actually guest starred on The Next Step as my bandmates. And we're here today in studio as Shane is working on songs for his first album. My man, first album, that's gotta be exciting. I know, it's it's really, it's all very exciting at this point. We're working on a lot of things and it's really overwhelming, but I think in a, the best way imaginable. When did you realize you love music? What were some influences early on in life that opened up this whole world of music to you? My family in general is very uh, musically inclined and my parents, uh, you know, showed me all their music that they listened to when they were younger and I think that really brought me to the next level of figuring out my own sound and figuring out the music that I listen to. Um, my sister, my older sister actually is a performer and actually got me into performing. Um, so I have to thank her for a lot. Uh, actually, if without her, I probably wouldn't even be here right now. So uh, my oh, family, amazing. yeah, my family for sure. So the first single yeah. is Let You Know. Right. So tell the viewers about the song. What is it about? Let You Know is about um, someone feeling feelings for someone and, and really not being able to let them know. <laughs> and I think a lot of kids do go through that. And especially people my age where, you know, they might have like a best friend that, you know, they've been best friends with for a really long time and right. then they start liking them and it's like, what do I do? Like, right, yeah, yeah, And yeah. you're afraid that if you say something, the person's gonna be like, no, you're like, you've been my best friend for like ever. Why would, <laughs> yeah, I, yeah. Why would I think it's about you that way? What are the important themes you use to write your songs? I, I think growing up is something that I've been finding myself writing mm -hmm. a lot lately. I mean, now that I am 18, I'm kind of at that point where I'm not a kid anymore, but I'm not an adult. It's right. hard. It's totally, really man, hard. totally. You're experiencing things that you haven't experienced before. Yeah, and um, I think it's something that even younger kids can go through too, especially kids that are going from, you know, being younger to being a teenager. It's totally. kind of the same transition. Same as almost like middle school to high school. Yeah, I mean. you're given responsibility that you haven't been given before. Right. Um, that's something that my writing really has been going towards lately. So tell me about your music. What do you hope fans take away from it? When people listen to my music, I hope that they take away the fact that they don't have to put themselves in a specific box. Definitely. The, if people like R&B and hip hop, they feel like they can't That's like- That's the only thing that they yeah, can like. They yeah, they can't like rock, or they can't mm -hmm. like jazz, or they can't like something else. And right. I want people to feel like that they can. Especially kids at a younger age, they, when they figure out what they like, they feel like they have to stick with that. Right. And I want to kind of break that mold. And I, I want people to take that away from right. the music. That so on the next step, we're in a band together, yeah. obviously. So what is it like combining music and acting? It's. It's really fun because yeah. I do love both of them. Right. I mean, music is my passion. It's kind of my baby, and it's mm -hmm. it's what I love to do. And acting is something that I don't necessarily put as much pressure on, but I right. love doing it because you know uh, I just so happen to be given the opportunity to do right. so. So combining them is just like the best of both worlds. So, what advice would you have for some of your young fans uh, who want to maybe become performers? I really think working hard is the biggest. Thing that anyone can do in this business. Mm -hmm. You have to be yourself, and you can't, like I said before, you can't put yourself in a box. You have to be able to, you know, try new things and push yourself, because mm -hmm. if you don't push yourself, you're not gonna get better. If you put your heart and soul into it, I know that, you know, the people that listen to this, to my music who are younger could right. do, you know, could be where I am totally. right now. Well, that's all the questions I got for you, my man. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> now you just got to know a little bit more about Shane Hart's. Till next time, family, take it easy.